Hey, I'm Jay from the Cub Scouts. Welcome to another episode of Yandere Simulator. This is the January 1st, 2016 update where you can now join clubs. You can join the Martial Arts Club and you can join the Occult Club. That sounds all fine and dandy, but there is something that I've been wanting to do for a very long time. And that is to punch Senpai in the dick with Yandere Punch. Got my falcon on, baby. This is so sick. Oh my god, I run really fast. Okay, where's Senpai? Senpai's right here. Oh yeah, he's gonna get the Yandere punch Yandere. right to the dick! Really, oh nigga. shit, I missed! <laughs> Alright, Yandere, Yandere punch right in his asshole! Oh! What's up, senpai? You like that? You like that Yandere punch? Who doesn't like that? Oh, you don't like Yandere. that? Well, too bad! Sayonara, motherfucker! You too! Snitch! Class has been cancelled today on the count of you just been Yandere punched! Hey, do they teach you this Yandere. in martial arts club? Oh! I don't think so. Hey kid, what's my favorite type of juice? Yandere! Punch, of course! Wait, who the hell is this guy? Before I Yandere punch the fuck out of you, I wanna know who you are. Daku Atsu! Reputation zero, personality, teacher's pet. Oh, teacher's pet? Oh, I'm gonna punch the hell out of you. Crush, none. Club occult. Strength and capable of self defense. One of the lenses of his glasses is completely opaque. No student has ever seen his right eye. Some students suspect that he only has one eye and prefers to wear an opaque lens over that eye rather than an eye patch. Huh, very interesting. Yandere. But you're gonna get punched! All right, Yandere punching people was all fine and dandy, but you know what's better than Yandere punching? One punching, baby. And I'm a sexy bald-headed hoe. But that doesn't matter, you know why? Because you just got one punched! Man, too bad I can't one-punch the hell out of Senpai. I'd be like, oh, you don't love me, Senpai? Uh! Oh, you have feelings for another girl? Uh! Yeah, because if I get too close, I can't one-punch him. But you know who I can one-punch? This hoe! <laughs> Punch you right in the titties! <laughs> hey, Budo, I heard you're a martial arts master. Do they teach you this in the club? I don't think so! <laughs> Thank you guys so much for flying one-punch airlines. Please sit down, fasten your seatbelts, and enjoy your flight! It can't be. It can be! Oh, you can't see what the teacher's writing on the chalkboard? Here, move a little closer! Be, why would anyone do this? Because I can! Hey, guess what, blonde-haired fuckboy? I found a new way to fly, you wanna see? BOOM! You know what, let's do this one in cinematic mode. I wanna see what it looks like when he flies across the room. Hi, Ryoto! Bye, Ryoto! <laughs> this is the most awesome thing that I've ever done in my life. No regrets. You know what? We have less than 30 seconds till the police come. I want to see what the police say. Like, all these people have been one punch to death. They are trying to find evidence. Oh! It can't be. Yes, it can be, no, teacher. It can't be. Oh, you're going to check on the student? Go ahead, check on him. Shut up. I'll punch you right in your vag, ho. We need help right away. Who the hell's talking? I think I just killed every single teacher in this game. But whatever. We have three seconds. And let's see if the police say everybody got one punch the fuck out of. The police arrive at school. The police discover the corpses of all these people in class. <laughs> oh my god, that is epic. The police are unable to locate any murder weapons because I used my bare fists. The police question Yandere John but cannot link her to any crimes. The police do not have enough evidence to perform an arrest. The police investigation ends and students are free to leave. Yandere John stalks Senpai until he has returned home safely and then returns to her own home. The leader of the martial arts club is dead. The remaining members of the club decide to disband the club. Okay, so that's one of the new things in the update. That's pretty cool. Alright, so I just one-punched and falcon-punched the fuck out of everybody so far. Time to join the martial arts club and the occult club. Okay, so in order for us to join the occult club and the martial arts club, it needs to be after school. So we're just going to put our stats in random ones right here. We don't really give two diddly dicks what we put our stats in. Just kind of like real life. If you're a slacker, you don't really care what you're good at. You're just trying to pass all your classes. So now it's after school. I think we're going to go to the martial arts club first because that's the one on this floor. And then we could do the occult club for later because I feel like that one's going to be a little bit more interesting than the martial arts club. And nobody's in here. All right, members of the martial arts club are starting to pour in. I think he's going to change, so I'm going to try to go in here with him. Ah! He's just going to twirl like an idiot until I get out of here. Fine. Go ahead. Change. Do you do what you got to do, man. I wish I could peep, though. wish I could be a little poon hound. Oh, there's Budo. What's up, Budo? No, let me go in here. Ah, oh, I'm in the changing room with Budo. Oh, oh, she's in here. I'm going to try to go in here with her. Oh, no. I didn't 
didn't see any goodies. Not that I wanted to. I'm not a pervert. <laughs> All right, let's talk to Budo. Welcome to the Martial Arts Club. What brings you here? Uh, let's get some information about your martial arts club. We study hand-to-hand -hand combat and practice self-defense techniques. If you join our club, I guarantee that you'll be able to defend yourself from anyone that might try to hurt you. If you think you've got what it takes, you're welcome to spar with any of our members at any time, even if you're not in the club. I don't know about you guys, but I thought Budo would have like a harsher Japanese accent and not like a Welcome to the Martial Arts Club! Interested in joining the club? All we ask is that you show up at least once a week. Damn, once a week? That's a lot to expect from me! If you join the Martial Arts Club, you will automatically win physical confrontations against students and teachers. Will you join the Martial Arts Club? Wait, 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 wait. If you join, you will automatically win physical confrontations against students and teachers? Can we finally kill teachers in this game? That would be so cool. Like, you know when you're trying to stab her and then she like stops you because she's like Robocop or something? Wow. That's actually pretty cool. Uh, I guess I'll join the Martial Arts Club right now. Fantastic! You are now an official member of the Martial Arts Club. I'm looking forward to teaching you everything I know. God, why does Budo talk like that? He's like, Fantastic! I am a dumbass with a stick up my ass. That's why I'm talking like this. Yeah, 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 yeah. Welcome to the Martial Arts Club. What brings you here? Let's try activity. We're not quite ready for club activities just yet. Come back anytime between 5 and 5.30. 5 and 5.30? God damn, that's an hour from now. All right, let's speed up time and get to 5 o'clock. All right, it is now 5 o'clock, and these two haven't thrown one single punch at each other. I'm beginning to suspect that they don't actually know how to fight, and one of them is waiting to make the first move. But whatever, I don't judge. Let's talk to Budo. Well, it is now 5 o'clock. Ready to start training? Yes, I'm ready to start training. Club activities last until 6 p.m. If you choose to participate in club activities now, the day will end. If you don't join by 5.30, you won't be able to participate in club activities today. If you don't participate in club activities at least once a week, you will be removed from the club. Will you participate in club activities? Yes! Excellent! Let's begin! Yes, let's begin, Budo! Why do no, you talk like you're enough. such an asshole? We must apply. Willing is not enough. We must do! The Martial Arts Club practices martial arts moves as the club leader shouts motivational quotes. Oh, I love that! Who doesn't love motivational quotes shout at you when you're, like, kicking with your right leg? I think that's all they're gonna do is just kick with their right leg. Okay, I've been watching this for about 45 seconds now, and it is confirmed that they really only do kick with their right leg. They said, fuck my left leg. Fuck punching with my right hand and my left hand. We are just going to practice our right kicks because that is all martial arts is about. So if you guys want to learn how to fight, just start kicking with your right legs like these guys. And you too can be a martial arts master. Let's continue. And Derechan stands near the school gate and waits for Senpai to leave school. Finally, Senpai exits the school. Yandere-chan's heart skips a beat when she sees him. Yandere-chan leaves school and watches Senpai walk home. Once he is safely home, Yandere-chan returns to her own home. Yay! So that was our first successful day at the Martial Arts Club. I'm gonna try to keep going there, and then maybe, just maybe, I can fight a teacher. Alright, let's change our clothes real quick. Yeah, look at us. Okay, I wore a black belt. I want to go hi on some bitches right now. But we have to wait until 5 o'clock, so we're going to speed up time one more time for the homie DJ Screw. Look at these two people. They're seriously just standing there. There we go. It's 5 p.m. Time to talk to Budo one time for the homie DJ Screw. Come on. There you go. Oh, man. I, no, I'm not trying to talk to you. Get out of here. Oh, God, Budo. Why? Why are you such a fuckboy? You're supposed to be a master. But you're a Damn disaster! Dude! Come on! Oh, please! You know what? Maybe I can get the girl to follow me. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Damn it! I didn't mean to change. Yeah, there's a glitch. I am literally changing outside of the changing room. There's really no purpose for the changing room right now because I can change out of it. Let's talk to this girl. Let's, uh. Damn, we can't get her to follow us right now. She's just gonna keep walking into damn Budo. Okay, so these two fuckboys apparently aren't going to get out of the changing room, so I have to reset this and come back again. Okay, I just reset the day. Budo is now standing here, but this guy's sparring partner is just walking into the wall slow motion. Look at this. Do you know how to change your clothes? 
Oh, okay. Oh, now you're gonna twirl like an idiot? Whatever, I'm done with you guys. Let's just talk to Budo to and to participate training? in the training. Yes. Excellent. Let's begin. Maybe we'll do something other than kicking. Knowing is not enough. We must apply. Willing is not enough. We must do. All right, I didn't want to talk over Budo shouting motivational quotes, but he's shouting the same motivational quotes. And we're also still doing right leg kicks. We apparently want to get that right leg so strong that we don't have to use any other body part or any other technique to win a fight. Like, if someone talks shit to us, we could just be like, what the fuck? And then right kick them right in the face. But anyway, let's continue this. Maybe I can just keep participating in the martial arts club and then I could fight a teacher. Because it said that you can win a physical confrontation with a teacher and that really like piques my interest. So maybe if I keep doing this until Friday, then I can fight a teacher. Okay, it is now Wednesday. Let Welcome us get our kick on. Excellent. Defeat is a state of mind. No one is ever defeated until defeat has been accepted as a reality. Oh, that was actually a new quote that he just said. Bravo, I'm impressed. I thought he was going to say the same shit, but he actually said a new motivational quote. He's probably been like reading them up online. He's like, all right, what new motivational quote am I going to say today for my kicking club? All right, it is now Thursday, my last time to train at the martial arts club before Friday, which is when I'm going to try to fight a teacher. Hopefully I can win unless this game is BSing me and I can't win a physical confrontation with a teacher. the fear within us when we know ourselves better. And now it is also confirmed that Budo does have several motivational quotes. So let's continue and get to school tomorrow and try to fight a teacher. So I was thinking about what weapon to use to beat a teacher with. And there is actually a saw over here in this garden area where you can, you know, use a new weapon and just slice bitches up with a saw, I guess. Or it's called a hacksaw, actually. So it's right in this house over here. And yeah, there's two circular saws. So I'm gonna pick this one up right here and I'm just gonna slice the teacher's ass with this. Don't mind me, guys. I'm just running with my hacksaw. Uh-oh, is that a knife? You shouldn't bring something like that to school. Are you dumb? This is obviously a saw, a knife. Oh my God, I should kill you with this right now. Okay, before I cut the teacher up with this saw, I kind of want to change into my uniform, you know, just to feel cool about myself. So let's change real quick. Let's creep up on this hoe. And for BAM! No! What the you're fuck? Doing? I thought if I joined the martial arts club, I could whoop your monkey ass, sensei. But apparently, you cannot be beaten. You are a damn god. Well, you guys just saw me join the martial arts club. Time to join the occult club and see what that's all about. All right, here we are. Got some new members of the occult club and they could be able to afford bookshelves and chairs now. Cool. All right. Man, what's up, girl? Who the hell is this? She's a new person. Let's take a pic of that. Wait, 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 wait. There we go. Look like she got some damn eggs on her head, but they're skulls. That's not creepy. All right, I guess I got to crouch on the ground try to take a picture of your face. The hell does she have an eye patch for? I can't get a good picture of her. The hell? Dude, stop reading that book. Look me in the face so I can take a picture of you. Eh, whatever. The hell is she reading anyway? Oh, okay. Book about demons and shit? That's not creepy at all. What about you? What are you reading? Whoa. Oh, you're reading about demons too? Okay. And she has an eye patch as well. You shitting me? Why do you guys both have eye patches? And I know this guy has that lens, right? Yeah, he does. Kind of looks like the main character in Persona. All right, he's reading about demons too. You know what? Everybody has a damn eye patch on. I'll do you guys one better. I have two eye patches on. Beat that, suckers! Anyway, let's talk to Oka. Um, hi. Hi, Oka. We are devoted to the research of supernatural and paranormal phenomena, which is ghosts. Vampires, demons, aliens, psychics, and time travelers are all welcome here. Anyone who joins our club will develop a resistance to horrific and terrifying things. Or succumb to them. <laughs> okay. Oka sounds like she has a cold, like her voice sounds kind of nasally. Do you need some like NyQuil or Tylenol or anything? I'll just join the club though. You, you actually want to join? 
If you join the occult club, your sanity will deplete at 50% of the normal rate and students will take longer to notice you. Will you join the occult club? Yes. This is wonderful news. Perhaps the world isn't such a dark and lonely place after all. Uh, um, anyway, you're an official member now. Yay! I have to say though, I'm not really digging the voices of Oka and Budo. I thought they would be a little bit different. I thought Budo would be a little bit more Japanese sounding, if that makes any sense. And I felt like Oka would be more soft-spoken. I mean, she is soft-spoken, but I just expected something different. But maybe I'll get used to it. Anyway, let's fast forward time to 5 o'clock and participate in the cult club activities. All right, it's now 5 p.m. Let's participate um, in the activity. We're going to attempt to summon a demon again. Will you help us? The hell? Summoning a demon at school? Is that even allowed? Do the teachers even know this shit's going on? All right, the club lasts until 6 p.m. Yeah, 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 let's participate. Excellent. I hope it works this time. Yeah. The cult club attempts to summon a demon. They do not succeed. All right, and they all have black robes on. Where the hell did they get that? Bed, bath, and beyond? And this damn music, man. All that's missing from this is some guy in the middle dancing with like a tiki torch going, hey, yeah, 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 hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, whatever, let's continue. Alright, and Yandere-chan stands near the school gate, you know, the same thing where she waits for Senpai to leave school. That was pretty cool. The occult club was interesting, Oka's voice was interesting, all the people wearing eye patches were interesting, but I had two, so I had to one-up them, you know how I do. But let's see some of the other new updates that the January 1st, 2016 build has. I'm just gonna go around the school, opening every door, see if I can find any new thing. Nurse still looking fine as hell with a double dams and a fat old ass. Faculty room, nothing in here yet. Oh wait, this is the main hall, okay. Counselor's office. Ooh, counselor, I wonder if we can kill her now. Probably not, can we falcon punch her? Yeah, let me try to falcon punch that ass. There we go. And Yandere, punch! punch! Nope, she is still invincible. Anyway, let's try to go open more doors. Music club? Nope, same old guitar case. Something is up with that guitar case. I'm gonna find out what it does one day. I promise you guys. One day I'll figure out the mystery of the guitar case. Art club. Nothing in the art club. Library. Oh good, nobody wants to go to the damn library. Student council room. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. There are some things going on in the student council room. Ooh, what's that on the computer? Somebody watching pornos? Oh. Is that Why have you come here? Have you come here to taunt me? Do you even know who I am? Infochan, right? I know who you are. I know what you are. My father won't allow me to attend school while you are active. He has a reason for tolerating your presence at this school. I don't. You are a vulgar creature that is only allowed to exist because you serve a purpose. If it was my decision, then every last one of you would be exterminated. Have fun while you can. If you and I ever cross paths, you're going to have a bad time. You're gonna have a bad time? That girl's been playing too much Undertale. The hell was she doing? on the laptop anyway. It was all too convenient for me to walk in and she was on the screen saying, hey, who are you? You're, you're Yandere-chan, aren't you? You're a crazy bitch. But that was actually pretty cool. I don't think that was Info-chan. That couldn't have been her because she didn't have glasses on. Her eyes were kind of covered by like some shadow or like some kind of visor or something. That was pretty cool. Glad I found this room. Let's see what other rooms there are in this game. Oh, computer lab. We already know what's going on here. Ryoto and Pippi. Art room again. Ooh, cool. Nice. Do we get to, like, do sculptures of, like, naked people that stand right there in the middle? That would be so awesome. Headmaster's office. We already know that. And last room of the day is another classroom. All right, there's another maze here at the other side of the school. I know that you can find manga books over here. You just gotta look, so it's kind of like a like a hunt kind of thing. There it is. So we found one of these books. Okay, okay, okay. Good fat material. Take that. 
and yeah i'm pretty sure there's like four or five books in here i'm not gonna look for all of them but this is a cool new place you can go to in the january 1st 2016 build here's another one boom oh my god i feel like i'm running in the same place i'm getting claustrophobic i want to get the fuck out of here now i'm serious i keep running in the same places everything looks the same I mean, that's the purpose of a maze. You kind of try to feel lost. There you go, finally. I couldn't find any more mangas. I just wanted to get out of there so I could see other updates, you know, in here. If I could find any more cool locations. Can I do anything at the gym over here? No. Yep, I can still go through walls. Yeah, okay. So the gym is still not an available feature in this game yet. But let me try running around. Just give the whole school a one roundabout real quick. So let's go fast. And there's the tree more walls and then this place over here again where I can get the hacksaw but let's see if there's something in here that I could do besides getting the saw nope looks like a good place to marry my senpai though one day one day I'll marry him over here and there's like a like a field where we can like plant like corn or some shit I don't know let's open this up and yeah the hacksaw is the only thing you can get I don't know why I keep calling it hacksaw it says circular saw same shit hacksaw circular saw Whatever. Wish I could grab these big ass scissors over here. They kind of look kid friendly though. The edges don't look too sharp. And then maybe you can get stuff like over here, like that bleach. Maybe you can like poison somebody with it, like pour bleach into their food or their drink later. That'd be a cool new feature. Just stuff like that. I'm just thinking about it. <laughs> Alright guys, that's going to do it for this episode of Yandere Simulator. This was the January 1st, 2016 build. I wanted to show you guys, you know, what was in here. So if you guys have any more myths, comments, or challenges that you want me to try in the next video, please put them in the comment section below. I can't wait to continue the Yandere Simulator myth series. So get creative. Get really creative. And make sure that you guys watch the other videos in the Yandere Simulator myths playlist. Because I have done a lot of the myths that you guys have written. In. so make sure you guys check that out before you write a comment but if you guys enjoyed this video please give it a like and tell a friend today that jay from the cub scouts is that dude